Good morning, my friends. It's me again, your favorite denture wearer. Sure hope everybody's doing okay today. I want to uh, jump on here real quick today and uh, Douglas Ball. I don't know if you're still watching my videos, but if you are, you need to check your Facebook settings, and I'll show you why. Every time you send me a message, you see that little blue line? that says I can't reply to this message okay that's what happens every time you send me a message and you've sent me lots of messages and I was able to reply up to a certain point I was able to reply up to a certain point right there and then after that I get this little blue line that says I can't reply to these messages and then if I click on learn more It says, if you're having trouble sending messages, download the new messenger app. I already did that. My phone updates automatically. And it says, if you're still having difficulty, the person you're trying to message either deactivated or deleted their account. You've been blocked by the person you're trying to message or uh, you're trying to respond to a group conversation that other members of the conversation have already left. So, something in your settings is keeping me from messaging you back. I'm not dissing you. I'm not, tr I'm not just not responding. I'm, I respond to all my messages. But for some reason, I cannot reply to your message. And there's a few others out there, a few of you out there, that the same thing happens with. There are several of you, as a matter of fact, that have sent me messages over the past six months and you didn't get a message back to me or from me because it says I cannot reply to this message. So, Doug, you're not the only one. There's others out there that have done that that, that I'm having issues with as well as far as replying to messages. So, the best thing you can do is comment on my YouTube videos. I reply to every single comment. I've never had an issue replying to comments on YouTube, but I've had issues trying to reply to messages on Facebook. So, if you want to talk to me, comment on YouTube. <laughs> Douglas and I have had some great conversations over the past two years and I don't want you to think that I'm dissing you in any way or that I don't like you in any or for any reason or that you've done something wrong or whatever the case may be. Just fix your Facebook so that I can reply to your messages, please. <laughs> like I said, we've had some really good conversations. I'm glad to hear that you're doing your music again. That's awesome. I will try to check that out. Um... You know, I spend the majority of my day, my morning, answering comments and messages and emails and replying to comments on other channels that I comment on, that I get a comment back on. So I spend the, the majority of my morning doing all of that. Um, that's, you know, four, four, four or five hours in the morning just sitting on the computer and replying to comments and messages and emails and checking other channels that I've commented on. Uh, there's a lot of newbies out there, um, new denture wearers that are doing videos, and I uh, will comment and see what I can do to help them out. Um, not as far as making videos. Uh, everybody has their own style of making videos, and that's fine, but I will comment, you know, if they're having trouble with biting or something like that, you know, I will comment on their video and try to give them a little advice. Whether they take it or not is entirely up to them. Um, so, yeah. Best thing you can do, if you want to converse with me, is do it on YouTube. Um, do it on the videos. Do it right here. Um, what else was I going to talk about today? Oh yeah, I went all day yesterday without my dentures again. I need to start doing that once a week again. Um, 
So, I just had a gagging fit, and I was talking to a uh, gentleman at a lab yesterday, and he said that if you start having a gagging fit, put a piece of ice in your mouth. Hold it right on the soft pallet behind the denture for a minute. Okay, move it around. Don't choke on it. And he said the gagging will stop. Um, I went all day yesterday without my dentures like I was saying. Okay, I don't even feel like I'm going to gag now. <laughs> okay. Um, <clears throat> what he said was, if you have any kind of a sinus issue at all, allergies or sinus infection or anything, what happens, your sinuses are connected to the roof of your mouth. And that soft tissue right behind the denture, if it gets irritated, you know, it, it swells a little bit, it'll cause you to gag. So that explains why when you get your immediate dentures, you gag so much because when they pull all your teeth, it irritates your sinuses and it swells that little piece of meat back there up. I don't know how to explain it, the soft palate. So, um, yeah, I had to turn off the camera and take my dentures out. I sniffed. I went <laughs> like that and just started flipping gagging and had about a 15 minute gagging fit I had to get my dentures out of my mouth and everything else you know how it is you're gagging so bad you can't stand it so you got to take the dentures out and then it's a fight to get the dentures out because you're gagging and you can't get the dentures out and so on and so forth anyway I put the dentures back in and put that ice on the roof of my mouth and it worked so try that give it a shot see what happens in the meantime, I'm going to, uh, I need to start going one day a week without my dentures anyway. I, I haven't been doing that as often as I should. It's usually like 10 or 14 days or something like that. I need to get back to the habit of going one day a week without my dentures. Um, because it really does tighten them up. It allows my gums a full 48 hours or 24 hours to, you know, 36 hours because I take them out at night. Um, it allows them to puff back up and get back in shape and everything else and it really does tighten up your dentures. I wear my dentures for so long, you know, I get up 7 o'clock in the morning, generally don't take them out until 11, 12 o'clock at night, so, um, you know, I wear my dentures for 16 hours a day, sometimes, uh, 15, 16 hours a day. Anyway, um... I hope everybody has a fantastic day. The ice worked, thank goodness. Uh, if I start to gag again, I'll do it again. But, uh, yeah, I, I, I talked to a lab. I was talking to the guy at the lab uh, yesterday about that because I've been having some gagging issues over the past week. I guess I've got a allergies or change of the season or sinus infection or something. So... Yeah, I'm happy that worked. I didn't have any gagging issues yesterday because I didn't have my dentures in. But if you have a gagging issue, put a piece of ice back there right behind the uh, palate of the denture, right on the soft tissue, and just kind of hold it there. Don't give yourself an ice cream headache, but just kind of hold it there and move it around and stuff, and don't choke on it, whatever you do. Use a really small piece. Okay, don't use a big piece that you could choke on. Use a piece small enough that if it goes back in your throat, you can actually swallow it. I hope everybody has a fantastic day. I will see you in my next video. Keep smiling, keep trying, and whatever you do, never give up.